Hello boys and girls. It is time for Wooldridge's Weekly Read Aloud And this week is week 33. This week we are going to read a story called We're Making Breakfast for Mother by Shirley Nitzel and the pictures are by Nancy Winslow Parker. <clears throat> Oops. Thumbs up for the title page. We're Making Breakfast for Mother. We know she'll have a super day since we're making breakfast for Mother. We're fixing up this shiny tray. We'll know, we know she'll have a super day since we're making breakfast for Mother. Here are some flowers. We picked her a bunch that decorate this shiny tray. We know she'll have a super day since we're making breakfast for Mother. <clears throat> Here is the cereal, the kind that goes crunch, that's next to the flowers. We picked her a bunch that decorate this shiny tray. We know she'll have a super day since we're making breakfast for Mother. Here is the sugar, lumpy and sweet. That's for the cereal, the kind that goes crunch, that's next to the flowers. We picked her a bunch that decorate this shiny tray. We know she'll have a super day since we're making breakfast for Mother. Here's the toast. We made whole wheat. It's beside the sugar, lumpy and sweet. That's for the cereal, the kind that goes crunch. That's next to the flowers. We picked her a bunch that decorate this shiny tray. We know she'll have a super day since we're making breakfast for Mother. Here is the tea. We brewed her a pot for dunking the toast. We made whole wheat. It's beside the sugar, lumpy and sweet. That's for the cereal, the kind that goes crunch. That's next to the flowers. We picked her a bunch that decorate this shiny tray. We know she'll have a super day since we're making breakfast for mother. <clears throat> Here's a banana with only one spot we put by the tea. We brewed her a pot for dunking the toast. We made whole wheat. It's beside the sugar, lumpy and sweet. That's for the cereal, the kind that goes crunch. That's next to the flowers. We picked her a bunch that decorate this shiny tray. We know she'll have a super day since we're making breakfast for mother. Here is the jelly, sticky and bright, that's near the banana with only one spot. We put by the tea, we brewed her a pot. For dunking the toast, we made whole wheat. It's beside the sugar, lumpy and sweet. That's for the cereal, the kind that goes crunch, that's next to the flowers. We picked her a bunch that decorate this shiny tray. We know she'll have a super day since we're making breakfast for mother. Here is some milk, frosty and white, to stand by the jam, sticky and bright. That's near the banana with only one spot. We put by the tea, we brewed her a pot. For dunking the toast, we made whole wheat. It's beside the sugar, lumpy and sweet. That's for the cereal, the kind that goes crunch. That's next to the flowers, we picked her a bunch. That decorate this shiny tray. We know she'll have a super day since we are making breakfast for Mother. Good morning, Mother. Happy day. Look at the flowers we've picked for your tray. Here's some milk. It was hard to pour. We brought you cereal. Some spilled on the floor. Here's sugar and tea. It's not very hot, and a banana with only one spot. 
Here's whole wheat toast, a little too brown. With raspberry jelly, oops, jelly side down. <clears throat> you made me breakfast? I'm impressed. Let's share this feast and then get dressed. Looks like they spilled it all over her bed. We'll put on our jackets and go for a hike, since I don't want to see what the kitchen looks like. It's fun making breakfast for Mother. Look, they went out for breakfast. So you think the mommy was happy that they made them breakfast? She probably was happy. But because they spilled it all over her bed, they ended up going out for breakfast. The end. I enjoyed reading with you boys and girls. I'm sorry my voice isn't what it normally is. But thank you for listening and reading with me. I can't wait till next time.